Welcome to Wisdom Flix Metaverse. Let's move on. Metaverse. The Metaverse is a hypothesized iteration of the internet supporting persistent online 3D virtual environments. Through conventional personal computing as well as virtual and augmented reality headsets. It's a combination of multiple elements of technology including virtual reality, augmented reality and video where users live within a digital universe. In March 2014, Facebook Incorporation acquired Oculus for 2.3 billion in cash and stock. Shortly afterwards, Oculus VR moved to Menlo Park as with Facebook. Supporters of the metaverse envision its users working, playing and staying connected with friends through everything from concerts and conferences to virtual trips around to the world. Mark Zuckerberg, the CEO of the newly named Meta, formerly Facebook, estimates it could take 5 to 10 years before the key features of the metaverse become mainstream. But aspects of metaverse already exist on platforms like VRChat or video games like Second Life. Meta, the tech giant formerly known as Facebook has already made significant investments in virtual reality, including the 2014 acquisition of Oculus. Meta envisions a virtual world where digital avatars connect to work, travel, or entertainment using VR headsets. Zuckerberg has been bullish on the metaverse, believing it could replace the internet as we know it. Their next platform and medium will even more immersive and embodied internet where you are in experience, not just looking at it. We call this as metaverse, said Meta CEO Mark Zuckerberg last month after revealing the company's rebrand. Facebook chose Meta because it can mean beyond. Decoding Meta Look Unlike traditional brand design processes, Facebook designed this symbol to live in motion and trading. It is designed to be experienced from different perspectives and interacted with it. It can resemble an M for Meta and also at times an infinity sign, symbolizing infinite horizons in the metaverse. The meta symbol was designed to dynamically live in the metaverse where you can move through it and around it. It can take on infinite textures, colors and movement, capturing the creativity and imagination of a 3D world. It was also important that the symbol take on a blue gradient and pull in the color of Facebook's core products, connecting its future to the company's origins. The metaverse is the next evolution of social technology where you can share immersive experiences with people even when you can't be together in person and do things together you couldn't do in the physical world. The suffix meta means behind or beyond. It can also mean more comprehensive and even transformative like metamorphosis. The second half of the world derives from the word universe and describes either a specific sphere or area or a fictional world or a speculative alternative universe. As a whole, the word metaverse generally refers to a virtual world that lies beyond, on top of or is an extension of the physical world. Mark Zuckerberg's version conjures an image of virtual everything. You attend work meetings as an avatar using the Quest VR headset and use a device on your wrist to secretly text your friends. When you go outside, you will wear smart glasses that offer an augmented reality as well as record what you see and hear. The metaverse will be accessible through phones, computers, wearable tech and headsets or a combination of this. And it will be where you work, shop, exercise, socialize, watch movies and game. Some lesser known companies have launched their own online worlds. The online fantasy world Second Life founded in 2003 is in its second decade as an alternate reality. Second Life is an application that allows people to create an avatar for themselves and have a second life in an online virtual world or metaverse. Developed and owned 
by the San Francisco based firm Linden Lab and launched on June 23, 2003. It saw rapid growth for some years and in 2013 it had approximately 1 million regular users. Growth stabilized and by the end of 2017 active user count had declined to between 8 lakhs and 9 lakhs. In many ways, Second Life is similar to massively multiplayer online role playing games. The virtual world can be accessed freely via Linden Labs own client software or via alternative third party viewers. Second Life users also called residents create virtual representations of themselves called avatars and are able to interact with places, objects and other avatars. They can explore the world, meet other residents, socialize participate in both individual and group activities, build, create, shop and trade virtual property and services with one another. Thank you for watching. Please like, share and subscribe our channel.